Well, welcome back everybody. So today we're going to be doing a video that I haven't really done uh, in a while. So it's going to be a uh, reaction video and it's going to be regarding uh, the election seething videos. So uh, it's going to be a cam free video. So we're just going to be reacting uh, to a whole bunch of these videos that uh, have been submitted to the 4chan. So all my videos uh, regarding uh, the uh, presidential election results uh, have been uh, declined for monetization. No idea why. He is the majority winner, not her. So again, I'm going to try and not make this into a mockery of the video, a mockery of people. I'm pretty sure there's going to be a lot of concerning things uh, in these videos. So without further ado, let's get into it. Here's what it is. For everyone that voted for that man, I want nothing to do with you. No I'm problem. not going to engage with you. No problem. And honestly, like if you leave comments on my page saying Trump 2024 or whatever, that's fine. Cause you're just making it easier for me to figure out who I should be blocking. <laughs> and a message for all of you that voted for him before I find you and block you. Uh -huh. I hope that you get absolutely everything that you voted for, genuinely. Uh, I don't think this is the message that you think it is, lady. I really hope that you do. And I don't want to hear a single complaint when it happens inevitably. If you voted. Well, that's why people voted for him, uh, Azal Azalia. For him. I don't want to see a singular story crying about how your wife or. <laughs> I'm so sad I'm making more money now. <laughs> Gas prices are lower, <laughs> taxes are lower. <laughs> I'm not getting attacked in the street anymore. <laughs> so sad. I don't know what the hell this girl's talking about. It, she's, her brains are clearly right over here. Your sister or your mother had some really some sort of reproductive struggle. I don't want to see a sob story about how your family, including yourself, is getting deported, and I don't want to see a GoFundMe or a singular peep out of the police using their full-blown immunity that he plans to Immunity. These people are hilarious. They have really no idea how the law and things like this work, but it's hilarious. Give to them. And I really don't want to hear you complain when the tariffs are implemented and you realize what that actually means for the economy and for your pockets. Let's hear what she thinks that, that actually means because this is what you wanted. And like I said, I hope that you get it. At the end of the day, Fingers I have crossed. to understand that I still Fingers am crossed. a very privileged woman. I am white. I live in California, which all the- Only the stupidest of the stupid people talk like this. So that will not protect me in the long run. It will protect me for a period of time. And if I have to, and I see fit, I have the income and the ability to move abroad to protect myself and my family and my loved ones. and. I would move abroad as well. I would move this broad. I will do what I need to do if it comes to that. But the rest of you that voted for him, I stand by what I said. Have the day you deserve. Dude, this one is metric ton crazy. So it's a whole bunch of uh, women that are shaving their heads uh, in protest for uh, uh, the magnanimous one uh, winning. Yeah. Story. Your feelings a bit. So a whole bunch of women shaving their heads. So remember, we had white dudes for Harris. Now we have a whole bunch of women shaving their heads. I don't have a problem with uh, women shaving their heads. Some women look fantastic with shaved heads. Hmm. 
white, 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 white. So uh, can we call this what it is? Uh, skinheads for Harris? Can we call that for what it is? Skinheads for Harris? What? Are your eyes deceiving you? Are your eyes lying to you? Are they not all bunch of white people shaving their head? Um, here's one. Boy, you sure are showing the Trump supporters. Baby. They don't give a shit about us. Our baby. <laughs> Alright, this one is not a real picture. She didn't really ship her head. head would... So many years, so many years. In a... Like, how? That is crazy stuff, man. Alright, then we have... Okay, this one, I saw this one yesterday. Uh, ladies, prepare. You're not ready for her. You're not ready for this, trust me. Hey, my fellow ladies out there. So, men think they own, own you. Take it from somebody that used to be a man. Used to be. Past tense. Now is clearly 100% certifiable woman. You got boobs. You got a vajayj. Breasts and vaginas. Use adult words. Guess what, honey? You own them. Trust me, they want it. Make them own it. So this... certifiable woman... just told you what this certifiable woman thinks of real women. They're just a bunch of body parts to F. That's what he, that's what this certifiable woman just said. You got boobs. You got a vajayjay. Guess what, honey? You own them. Trust me, they want it. Make them own it. Man, that is creepy as hell. Okay. Her body, my choice. Men are going to have to start doing a say. Do it. Her body, my choice. Men are gonna have to start doing a say. Who talk? Who? Do it. Give me a reason. I I don't understand. I don't understand. Okay, let's see what this guy has to say. Listen, if I hear any dude tell a girl, "Your body, my choice," I'm gonna immediately knock your fucking teeth down your throat. Who talks like that? I've never in my life heard a person talk like that. Your body, my choice. Oh, I know where they hear this from, in their heads. Likely their own head cannon. likely what they say to themselves when they see a woman. You've been warned. Listen, if I hear any dude tell a girl your body, my choice. I'm going to immediately knock your fucking teeth down your throat. All right, that's... That's... Uh-oh. Okay, I think we might have to brace for some tears. All right. And to know that my family, the people who raised me, voted for a rapist. No, they didn't. It's so invalidating. But I'm white. I shouldn't. I should not. You should not be on the internet. You should not be posting this video. You should put your phone away. You should get off TikTok. You should get off all your social media. You should go outside. You should experience life. You are. You look young. You should be protecting your mental health. Be taking. 
up space because right now the people who have it much worse than I do are people who don't share the same skin color as me which is so like why are we still judging people on that race is a fucking social construct that white people created to make themselves feel good about the dehumanization of other people what the fuck man okay i'm looking more for the political meltdown so nobody's gonna do it huh do what nobody's gonna be let me guess she's about to say something violent or completely unhinged. Be like, come on, feds, do your job. Investigate election fraud. <laughs> Nobody, nobody's gonna. Good luck with be that. Be like, come on, feds, do your job. Go arrest that demagogue. Nobody, huh? I mean, like we all feel something. Is going down, so. Oh, well, it's in your I don't know about you, but um, I know. Kamala, Joe, they both said Trump won, fair and square. What the funny thing is, they're trying to get Joe to step down so Kamala could take over for the rest of the year, but they're not. They're not interested in that. A lot of us have decided to not. A desperate, pathetic woman. Be as nice anymore. And I know a lot of us don't be nice anymore. Oh, a lot of us have decided to not be as nice anymore. Oh, we've seen your violent threats on the internet already. We've seen hundreds, thousands of violent threats on Twitter and that wishes for death from from you, uh, from you guys. Or and I know a lot of us don't want to sound crazy, but I really don't think a... Are you sure about that? Because you all seem to be out here putting out these videos, looking and sounding completely... Cheater. You know, cheating again is that crazy of an idea. Just saying. Get off the internet. All right, what does this guy got to say? The more I watch that clip of Kamala walking away, don't care if I sound delusional, the more I feel like things are gonna be okay. She practically went, you know, sometimes the fight takes longer. Just give me five minutes. <laughs> I'm gonna say it because I'm Australian and I live in Australia and I don't have to worry about the Secret Service or the FBI knocking. Um. Okay, let's hear what he's got to say. On my fucking door, and even if they did, more than welcome to come over, I'll make them a fucking cup of tea. I wish the bullet didn't miss. You're welcome. What is wrong with you? Wishing death on people. Crazy. That is crazy. The knowledge that Trump won the popular vote has actually destroyed my worldview. I think I always had solace in the fact... It's reality. It is reality. He just won his third election. It's reality. But it wasn't the majority of people voting for Trump. Like when really? Hillary Clinton won the popular vote, that was kind of, kind of like, okay, so I'm not crazy. Like I'm not in the minority of people who want rights, even though it wasn't like a vast. I, I love how these people are, are always talking about rights when they're the people who are trying to take rights from people. Minority. Of Trump supporters compared to Hillary Clinton supporters, it was still like, oh, like everything's still okay, you know. But now there's no denying it. The difference is so huge, and I actually feel insane. Like at school today, I know it's been two days since we figured out. Well, you feel insane because the world that you live in is not real. You're trying to convince yourself the things that you're seeing on Twitter and TikTok are reality when they're not who won the election, but I was so sad today. And I just looked around and everyone else seemed like relatively normal. It's like, I can't get past this. It's like everything I've ever learned and everything I've ever comprehended in my own brain has been shattered. Yeah, because you've been lied to and manipulated. It's really sad. There's nothing I can do. What do these two have to say? The thing that's really just spinning my wheels in the mud today is um, how, how can some people say they love me 
I didn't say that. But then they voted against me. <laughs> How could you go to my wedding where I married my wife and um, raise that pride flag so high up in the air? <sighs> deep breath, guys. Deep breath. But then you voted against me. You voted against my rights. You voted against my How family. How dare you, you vote voted against, against me? My marriage. You voted against everything that Her I marriage. thought you stood for. Her democracy. And we're just supposed to. Love Not democracy, but their democracy. You know, it's okay, we can agree to disagree. We can just see past it. Don't let politics ruin relationships. I remember that. It's crazy how people are allowing this stuff to destroy their lives and their relationships. It really is crazy. Okay, so we could actually stop DJT from becoming elected because if oh, he committed um, schmelection rod. <laughs> How about you talk without a f stupid filter? How about you talk without a filter? Um, he did it while he was a private citizen, as did Elon, obviously. Take me seriously while I have this silly filter on. She likes to be inside my sweater. Okay. So they could both be prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law because it occurred while they were private citizens. And not just them, but anyone who was colluding with them. And because they would be accused of very serious crimes such as treason and perhaps uh, colluding with a foreign entity, things like that. What? Okay, look, uh, I haven't been on TikTok forever. I locked myself out of my account. Because uh, that place is disgusting. Why is it that every TikToker stops their their video while they're recording, and then like, is it because they can't they can't keep a sentence going or a thought going for more than five seconds? They have to keep on stopping in between uh, thoughts. It's really off putting. It's highly unlikely that they would move forward um, with inauguration day. She's so distracting. I love her though. She's down. such a goob. She really just, she really just, this is her favorite thing. Okay. This is her favorite. <laughs> oh, she got side sidetracked, lost her thought completely. The meow got her. The meow got her. We should just start leaving our dirty tampons everywhere. Because if men want so much control over us, they can deal with our dirty tampons. Clean it up. No, but genuinely, I was trying to think like, ooh, like what revenge sounds the most satisfying right now? And I kind of just want to fling dirty tampons at men's cars. Yeah, men, memorize that face. Do not get involved. Schizophrenia. They're trucks. Ooh. <laughs> hmm. What a stupid girl. What a stupid girl. Okay. Can someone tell me what? <sighs> Can someone tell me what the Mega Man find the track? <laughs> not. I'll give you a hint. It's not whatever you're doing. Mega men find attractive, so that I can wear the complete opposite. You're already doing it. You're already doing it. You're already wearing it, and you're already acting the complete opposite of what men find attractive. Thanks. No problem. No problem, lady. Right, we'll do a few more. You gotta be fucking sucking my dick right now. There's absolutely no way that you're... I'm, I'm an election... You've got no dick to suck, so shut the hell up, you stupid... Re ...denier. I am now going to be a fucking election denier. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it! This literally confirms everything that I've been feeling lately. Stupid. Number one, why in the flying freaking flap? Okay, we're voting, voting fucking ballot or voting ballot boxes or whatever, you know, places, the places where you go to fucking vote. Why were they connected to the Internet? We know what? that this connects <laughs> Trump, Musk, Starlink and hundreds of thousands so far, probably apparently millions of undocumented votes. Undocumented. What? We um, know that there's something fishy going words. on, and we're just, we're... 
Harris is in the process of kicking, <laughs> kicking the door down. When we're, we're getting it back, I, I, I can just feel it in my bones. Donald Trump yes, is a Russian control. asset. He is. Mm. And, and if Preach, you don't brother. believe that, Preach. it doesn't make it less true. If you are a low information voter and you don't understand what I'm saying by that, it doesn't make it less true. Well, we don't understand what you're you saying because what you're saying is understand. not You cannot convince reality. me that that many people that fucking hate Donald Trump, that piece of shit motherfucker, there's no way that he got the popular vote. And this time he won the popular by almost 5 million. He got the fucking House and the Senate. Yep. and the presidency it just yep. doesn't make any fucking sense it really doesn't his rallies were small it's because people are tired of you people we are all tired of you smaller than they've ever been and people were leaving before they were over and he's 13 million votes more popular well, that's hmm. one of his rallies i don't buy it they use starling to tally the votes and now you can't convince me that Elon Musk is not the dumbest person in the fucking world. Like, that sounds like a booby trap. You've You're definitely never been smarter a than him. Criminal before, sure. have you? Now, all of a sudden, he wants to come in here and talk about, oh, well, I'm going to go ahead and help you because I know, you know, there's a lot more people voting and it's going to be difficult. There's this net. There's not a lot of people that you volunteer to help. Blah, 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 blah. You know, let me help you to tally up the votes in order to be able to help you guys and make things easier for you. Oh, what a sweetheart you are. What a sweetheart you he are. Is. But for those of us who know the business, we're not dumb. And the people are going to come to yes, you and you say, Completely. we want to use your store link <laughs> to tell your votes. And you're going to do it like a dummy. You're going to do it like a dummy. It just, it makes sense. It makes sense that <laughs> Starlink actually. is a part of this. And Elon Musk had... It makes as much sense It makes sense, sense why a, Elon Musk is in this why he just suddenly came out of nowhere all those states on the east side of the the united states you know like the states that really count when they got the hurricane who came in and offered them uh like internet access with starlink how dare he how dare he help people out <laughs> with i think uh, i think it was also uh free internet you guys could correct me if i'm wrong but uh how could he help people, huh? How many people signed up for Starlink? And if this whole Starlink thing is correct, holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Why would we sit down and let these motherfuckers ruin our country? I'm not going to do it. Please repost this and get it out. I don't give a fuck if I... I don't oh, care. Oh, people are reposting these the videos. Share it with the fucking masses, bro. Fucking but please. Not for because everybody the deserves to know. So your lawn maintenance is about to skyrocket because 90% of workers in the lawn maintenance industry, they come from Mexico. And you guys remember that, uh, I think it was on The View, uh, Ozzy Osbourne's daughter, you know, trying to give a jab to Trump by saying, if you deport all the Mexicans, who's going to clean your toilets? That's pretty much what these racists are saying now and whether they're here legally or not Stephen Miller who Trump's going to put in charge of his mass deportation project is going to deport them they're also going to deport people who are naturalized citizens these are jobs that Americans will not do okay American families are not letting their young adults work in the lawn maintenance industry these companies may be owned by Americans, what are you but their employees about? are from Mexico. So not only will it be... Uh, she looks like she's going to have a... Tell me you're an Antifa member without telling me you're an Antifa member. I thought I'm sorry, but the primary reason that Trump won wasn't because Joe Biden got out of the race too late or that Democrats don't understand or ignore the working class. Uh -huh. Like I've said, the primary reason Kamala didn't win is that millions of Americans were... Did not like her. Nobody liked her. Everybody was sick and tired of hearing and seeing her. She paid millions and millions of dollars to celebrities to boost her. People didn't care. People went to the rallies to see the celebrities. 
not to support camel ass. We're deceived by the Trump campaign, complicit Republicans, the right wing media ecosystem, Elon Musk, and a gargantuan amount of dark money all supported by malleable algorithms. These these devious forces for Yeah, mind you the algorithms for YouTube, TikTok, Twitter are all boosting you idiots, by the way. I made a I made a couple of Trump videos and each one of them got demonetized and re declined for advertisements. Tended that one, the economy was better four years ago when we were on the cusp of economic collapse. Two, that Trump had no real responsibility for the COVID catastrophe. Three, that crime was up. Four, that inflation hadn't been brought down and was the fault of Democrats in the Relax, first place. And five, man. all of our problems Relax. stemmed from poor immigrants in search of a better life. Plus, a transgender commercial proved incredibly effective in suggesting that Kamala was someone she isn't. So, as Democrats and pundits endlessly scrutinize this election, I say that we and our beliefs aren't the real problem. Instead, the number one issue is that the American people were deceived by devious forces spewing unending dishonesty. Do you agree? Nope. Nope. I just want to say, I know this week has been um, an incredibly difficult week for a lot of us. That's been all right so far. Thank you. It's been I, 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 difficult. Is I, 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 There's just no words. Just right? disconnect it's, from it's the internet. Understand. You'll be all right. It's, it's been um, a lot. What I came on here to say, first and foremost, is that if you are someone who mm -hmm. is online right now, commenting, reposting stories, or making fun of the people who are sad this week, or belittling them, um, mocking I'm not. them. I'm not. If that's something that you are actively doing and finding joy in online right now. Um, no, what people are trying to do is show you guys that what you're doing is not helping you or anybody. You guys are working yourselves up into this frenzy. And there's all sorts of violent stuff all over the internet for people who voted for Trump. That's crazy stuff. Like, truly... Yeah, Just exactly the what you're doing now. These. How dare you try to invalidate something that an entire group, multiple groups of humans are going through right now, whether they're feeling scared or helpless? Any of those feelings, a human, would you laugh at another human when you see that they're obviously struggling? Fuck the biggest of dicks. And I don't mean, I don't mean that negative. Okay, I want to do one more for B. Queens, what is this? I've been seeing this 4B stuff. Not sure why no one understands how I feel. You guys know that my husband turned Republican this term. I don't know why. Oh, no. Threw his oh, God, ass no. out of oh, the God. house. And um, I she kicked her husband out of the house because he voted for Trump. This is not normal people behavior. And if it was vice versa, it still would not be normal people behavior you do not disown family over this stuff man you s i have to do more i don't want to shave my head because that's going to hurt him i'm going to look ugly so kicking your husband out of the house is also hurting you you stupid idiot i'm not doing that i think i'm gonna sleep with his friends I jesus christ i think that's the only way I think sleeping with his friends will do. What do you guys think? His liberal friends, of course. I, I, I have no words. I think it's a good idea to end it uh, over here. I have a headache that's been building up since minute number two. Since I started watching these uh, videos, you guys need to get off the internet. What you're doing is not helping you. It's not helping whatever cause you think that you guys are part of yes there are people who are making fun of you but these are also not right people but also a lot of people feel vindicated because for years and years you guys have been doing this stuff to us and finally last year people started fighting back 
a lot more aggressively than you guys were used to. All right, so guys, uh, I appreciate you guys uh, watching this uh, video. Let's see what YouTube decides to do with this video. And uh, let me know what you guys think. If you enjoyed the video, drop a like, subscribe, come back for more content. This is mostly a gaming and entertainment channel. Just every once in a while, I'll do a video like this. So I appreciate you guys giving me some of your time today. And I'll catch you on the next one. Jiga, Vega, Michael, out.